Well, another night shift in the books. You know you're in a big machine when you're looking down on a one-ton dually. This is about the only thing that makes that truck look small. All right, well, my shift is over, but I'm going to miss this thing when it's gone. This is a dozer that I would highly recommend for moving big dirt. This John Deere 750, it gets it done. Been really happy. Visibility is great. The lighting when you're doing the work at night, fantastic. worked a few nights in a light rain and there's literally wipers on every single piece of glass so that's pretty cool this is the beginning of two ditch ditches this field this is a hundred it's at least this is a good hundred acres plus at the hardwoods a ditch literally starts here and it goes right through there right between the trees 
then the overflow to the pond is right there. So this goes out and you can see all the overgrown grass and weeds, nice tall stuff. So these come together right here underneath the power line. So a bait pile out there, 65 yards, that's going to be you, brother. This is going to come down. They've been, they've been put uh, night and day taking the soybean down. All the soybeans are down over there now. I'm going to put the other blind right there. I should have this covered. we got deer coming from across the street. There's hardwoods. They come right into the ditch and funnel right down into here. And they go along the river and they cut across the farm. And I know they can swim, but they're not going to cross that. So they either got to come here or over there. The deer, they bed right under those trees. I'm going to put a bait pile 65. Oh, I'm going to feed the squirrels. My squirrel feeder is going to go 65. That's what it's going to be. And they travel right through there. I mean, just so much deer traffic in there. It's unbelievable. So here's one of the stump threes. I'll show you what it's like inside. All right, so beautiful, beautiful shooting. Now these are, look at these hinges. Nothing makes noise. Nothing makes noise. Super, super quiet. And then these camouflage curtains go behind you so that they can't see through. Here's another. They travel down in here. They keep to the low. And then Sometimes they just, they come right through here. But there's four windows, a fifth window in the door. Everything is super, super quiet. I mean, it's all beautiful. It's vented, carpeted, walls are soundproof. A bow hook, cross venting, one up, one down. Here's a hook for your coat, one piece, no leaks. If you happen to make a little bit of noise, this is supposed to help deaden it. Carpet on the floor so it's really quiet. Okay, magazine rack, I'm just kidding. All right, so that's the stump three. This is one of them, super stoked. Very, very comfortable. A few subscribers wanted to know how the canal turned out. It turned out really nice. It's got a about 60 foot span from bank to bank. So it's, it's a, and we went deep. You know, we were probably 18 feet deep on this canal. We needed the dirt, made a really, really nice driveway over here. Yeah, we put 10 double culverts in, you know, 40 feet of culvert. Uh, that's a 24 inch dual wall Poffman tile. Okay, so the driveway winds all the way around here. Never had that before, so this is a big piece of property. It's 96 acres, so it's easy to. Uh, now it's easy to 
you know, cut through the property. This was never any good. It was just too low to be used for anything. And it, it's been tried, you know, as far as farming, things like that. And this area just was always so wet, nothing would grow here. You know, some some cattails, and that's about it. So it was obvious. Let's let's grab the dirt from the lowest point. Let's create an area for to catch runoff keep this property dry and then that way we can also utilize the dirt in a low area build up a really nice beautiful drive now you know we got some edison edison easement here so this is just some red tape you know this is kind of common and normal so we had to put in a service drive right there uh quite frankly when the dust settles you know about a year from now that's getting blown out so that you know kayaks and canoes because there's a there's a body of water over here and What's nice is, you know, so that's about a four acre. So there's, this goes to a six acre in the corner over there. So I'll do an aerial. I'll do. I'll have my drone fly through this and show you. But I couldn't be happier. We just hit it. You know, this is as good of, of a finish grade as you could possibly hope for with a D7, and I'm really happy uh, with it. Uh, you know, me and my guys were, were good. We put, in, we put in the time, got it done. Old man winter's coming, and we got a heck of a rainstorm coming our way. So we just finished this yesterday, and because it was just go, 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 I couldn't stop and, and really shoot any video for you guys. So that's why I'm I'm showing you this now. I'll show you some, some culvert installations of this project, as well as when we flooded this canal. All right, guys. Stay tuned. All right, when you look at the ground, you're probably wondering what is going on. It almost looks like when you're driving up on it, like it's a bunch of little anthills. All right, man, I'm gonna show you what this is all about. Look at that big fucking dog right there, man. I just seen a buck run in the farm. Look at all the deer tracks. Look at all the deer tracks. Is this not ridiculous or what? I mean, we got some big boys in here. I mean, there's no doubt. No doubt, man. Yeah, I seen a buck run in the farm today. Look at that. God dang. Look at that. All right. Beautiful. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Look at all the tracks. Look at all the tracks. Look at the tracks. Holy. 
smokes. Man, it's just like a. It looks like a. You know, like a horse pen. You know, just hoof marks everywhere. Look at that. Yeah, I'm pretty excited. Look at this, man. Some drainage guy dug a canal. It hasn't rained in like a, in a very, very long time, but look at that. Look at that. I must have graded the property right because we haven't had rain in five days. Look at that. Still draining out. Isn't that fucking beautiful? I absolutely love that. So the canal is filling up, as you can see. Man, look at the deer tracks. Oh, man. Holy shit. Man, and there's a big heavy dog. Look at that. Woo. We got some big deer in here, man. Can't wait to see him. Can't wait to see him. It's unbelievable. I'm gonna be sitting right there. Time to get my chair in place. Beautiful. Oops, there's a little bit of uh, some spilled, some spilled carrots. <laughs> Got a trail of carrots. I don't know where it came from, but I'm sure the deer really like it. Just just goes right through the property. All right, we got deer tracks. Some big deer tracks. And I just wanted to show you where these deer tracks go. Just figured I would, uh, look at that, man. Look at that, big, big deer, big deer. Curious deer. That's hilarious. 